Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for April 2nd of 2024 is titled Detailed View of a Solar Eclipse Corona. So what do we see here? Well, here we see an image of our moon in front of our sun. Now, if you can see very faint features on the moon there, and that's because we're looking at the unilluminated side of the moon. And what we're seeing around it is actually what we call the solar corona. Now, the corona itself is the region of the solar atmosphere. So our sun, much like the Earth, has an atmosphere that extends outward around it. And the sun's atmosphere can be very active. And we can see some of that with all of the streamers and some of the solar prominences around the edge of the limb of the moon there. Now, the, normally we cannot see the solar corona and it's always there. It's just very faint by comparison to the rest of the sun. So when the sun is out, we can't see the corona because the overall brightness of the photosphere or surface of the sun blocks that out and keeps us from being able to see the corona. However, during an eclipse, our moon passes in front of the sun and blocks out the bright photosphere. And that's what it's doing right here, allowing us to see the region around the sun that now becomes visible. And that is the corona or the atmosphere of the sun. Now, the solar corona can be more or less active depending on what's going on on the surface of the sun. The sun goes through an 11 year cycle of activity. So during that time, it will go from being very inactive to reaching a maximum of activity and then back down to a very inactive again. And at this point, we're on our way up to the more active region of the sun. So the sun is getting more active. And here we see an image taken during the total eclipse that occurred last year on April 20th of 2023. So we're seeing relatively recently within the last year as to how active the sun was. Now, what does the corona look like now? Well, we're going to find out in just a few days now. And in fact, in less than a week, we are going to have another total solar eclipse where our moon will pass in front of our sun and block out its light. And if you happen to be located in the right part of the world, in this case, uh, eastern portions of North America, you will have a chance to see the corona. But you've got to be in exactly the right spot where that path goes through the eastern portion from uh, Mexico up through Texas and then up out through the northeastern part of the United States and eastern Canada. So if you're in that path where the moon will be seen to pass directly in front of the sun, you'll have a chance to perhaps see something much like the image that we see today. So that was our picture of the day for April 2nd of 2024. It was titled Detailed View of a Solar Eclipse Corona. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Celestial Fireworks. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.